Hello and welcome back to the Bad Hipster Channel. I am John, and today we will be reviewing and taste testing a new soda that just came out. Now, in the past, I have done a s'mores Pepsi, which had like a marshmallowy flavor supposedly to it. Um, maybe something else I've tried drink wise has had a marshmallow flavor to it. Can't think of any off the top of my head. But I know that there's that one. Anyway, Coca-Cola just came out with their own marshmallow soda. However, this is the Artist Marshmallows Limited Edition Coca-Cola. And there is no marshmallow flavor. It is a watermelon strawberry flavored coke even though it's called marshmallow the artist marshmallows limited edition and you can get it in both a regular and in a sugar a zero sugar form the cans are pretty much identical the zero sugar one uh just has the lettering filled in and the, the eyes and the mouth filled in, whereas the regular one has just the outline and the, not on the other ones. And on the back, you can see that the regular one has a red nutritional label, and the zero sugar one has a black nutritional label. This is the next in the line of the Coca-Cola Creations. Um, remember the Stardust was terrible. And then there was the pixel one, which, although who knows what a pixel tastes like, it uh, was just like a kind of like a fruity, a generic fruity flavor. I don't know if this is lighting on my beard here, so I just like wanted to go that way for some reason. Who knows? Anyway, let's go ahead and open them up. I'm going to do the regular full sugar version first, and then we will compare that to the zero sugar and see if it tastes just as good, better, or noticeably worse. Here we go. Marshmallow. The artist marshmallow. Okay. It does have a fruity smell to it. I don't know if I can distinguish watermelon and strawberry, but it does smell fruity. Yeah. It has like a candy fruity flavor to it. Of course, there's no uh, fruit juice in it. The nutritional information is actually quite simple. Carbonated water, high fructose corn syrup, caramel color, phosphoric acid, natural flavor, and caffeine. The zero sugar one has carbonated water, caramel color, phosphoric acid, natural flavors, aspartame, sodium benzoate, sodium citrate, Asulfame, potassium, and caffeine. The zero sugar one definitely has more stuff to it. It doesn't taste bad. Way better than the Stardust. If I had the pixel on here to compare it to, it probably tastes pretty similar. It's just like a Coca-Cola with a not not cherry, but some other like red fruit. In this case, it says watermelon strawberry. I feel like I could distinguish like a, a real watermelon or a real strawberry smell or flavor. I'm not really getting that. So it's definitely like an artificial candy kind of flavoring that's supposed to imitate strawberry and watermelon. It's not bad. Let's go ahead and try the zero sugar one. And see if it tastes just as good. We're going to compare the smells. Generically 
Booty. Smell wise, identical. The full sugar one might have a slightly sweeter aroma. That makes sense. Here we go. Taste the fortune one. The experience is almost identical. The full sugar one and the zero sugar one. There is a any difference in the flavor. I wouldn't say like, oh, you'd never be able to tell which one's which. But the difference is negligible. It almost feels like the carbonation in the zero sugar one is more intense. There's a little more bubbly sting on the tongue. The full sugar one just has like a, a softer feel to it, but the flavors are pretty much the same. Um, Would I suggest that you absolutely have to go out and get this? No, it's not too special. Um, especially if you taste the pixel one already. It's a generically fruity kind of flavored Coca-Cola. I will say, if uh, you don't like uh, full sugar things, the zero sugar one is just as good. Um, some people might even say it's better. But... I'll give this one a thumbs up. I think Coca-Cola, this one, definitely is, is good. It's drinkable. It's not necessarily something everyone's going to love. Or something that you necessarily need to go run out and get yourself. Um, you could probably get this, like, if you went to a movie theater or a store that had, like, the Coca-Cola creation machines. Just select the Coke, press the strawberry flavor, fill it up halfway, press the watermelon flavor, fill that up halfway, and basically you got yourself a watermelon strawberry Coca-Cola. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Coca-Cola, the artist, Marshmallows Limited Edition. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel, not anyone else's channel. Well, you can, but that's all I'm telling you to do. Subscribe to this one. And I'll see you again later.